Hello everyone, Dan from Frontline MCOC here, back with another video for Marvel Contest of Champions. As you can see, the timer on my free 7-day trial of the Summoner Sigil is ticking down. Uh, there is just under 5 hours left. And I'm going to show you why that is important, because if you go over to my overflow inventory, I have 4 T4 um, CC uh, tech in the overflow right now. And the reason I have that many in the overflow is because I was short on mutant and I want to be able to rank five my name more soon. Uh, so I had to open a bunch of crystals and of course that put me over on tech. Now if you go to the, um, the inventory for tier four catalyst, right? You're going to see that the current inventory is at 20. Okay, now that's with the summoner sigil. Uh, it's 20 with the sigil, but that's going to drop down to 16 once my sigil expires. Now, for the catalysts that are already in my inventory, uh, as you can see, I'm over 16 on, on skill, and I'm at the max 20 for tech. That's not a problem. Nothing bad is going to happen to those. Where it becomes a problem is if you have... Uh, extra in the overflow on top of the 20 because the inventory is going to go down to 16. So that means if I start spending T4CC uh, tech, that's not going to go into my regular inventory. It's going to stay in the overflow until I get under the 16. So for example, if I rank uh, three a five-star tech champion, that would take um, three T4CC tech, right? That would bring me down to 17, which would still be over the 16 cap, and those four would stay in the overflow. So I would actually, um, I would need to spend four to get back to, um, back to even, back to the 16, right? And then I would need to spend another four to get down to 12, so I could pull these four out of the overflow before they expire in the next 30 days. Or I could do some rank ups now and uh, use use the current inventory that I have, that current 20 space. And if I just spend four, then I can pull these four out of the overflow and um, I don't have to spend eight. I only have to spend four. So do I have any good candidates to use four or more uh, tech T4CC. Well, we go to tech. We go to five star. We hit rank up. And who do we see? We see Star Lord. We see Hulkbuster. He's got a um, he's got a buff coming in June, but we don't know uh, if we're gonna get the the beta Hulkbuster or they're gonna tweak it yet. So that's still a little bit risky. Also, I have a six star Hulkbuster, an unduped six star Hulkbuster, but still, I have a six star Hulkbuster, and if he's that good. I'll probably want to invest in the six star. And then we have Ghost. Ghost is pretty good. I will admit I have been holding out on Ghost for a long, long time. I admit she's good. Um, I'm just not great at the playstyle, and I've never really spent the, the time to properly learn her. Uh, but it it is time. It is time to rank her up. Um, the inventory space aside, I have to. She is, she's a phenomenal champ. She can definitely help me in Act Six. And uh, what's more than that, I also have two Tech Awakening gems, so I can awaken her. And the only reason I'm not going to do that right now is because I'm going to be a good Alliance member and wait until item use is on. But I am going to upgrade here. As you can see, I have. Um, four of the the tier five basic i've almost got a fifth one and everything else i have i've got just barely enough gold so we are going to hit the button and i am now the proud owner of a uh five star rank five ghost and of course i am not going to level her up right now because level up is not on and i want to wait to um get the revive and get the units so now we go over and as you can see let's go to the not the overflow let's go to the inventory so that i can show you exactly what happened we change that to um 
tier uh, tier four CC. Right now, I am down to fourteen out of twenty because the sigil hasn't expired. Claim that, and I am good to go. And now I'm down to eighteen. So uh, you, by doing this now, I was able to save myself some space and not have to spend those T four CC uh, later. And um, I'm just of the mindset that I'm not going to let T four CC expire no matter what i want to rank up those champs they can help me down the lot nine i might need a champ for arena i might need the champ for something else so it's all just about improving uh my roster and not letting those go to waste so um that is pretty much it for this one um i do want to tell you guys i do have some more rank ups coming that namor uh he's definitely going to be my next um rank five five star uh, i do have an awakening gem for him and i have about 130 sig stones that are going to go into him um, when we get the next item use so um he's definitely going up and then as far as six stars after i rank up the namor i am probably going to um rank to my champion for uh incursions uh, because he complements mephisto so well he's part of one of my main incursion teams and i actually really do like playing him and as you know uh if you've read the blog or watched uh any of my footage i really like playing mephisto and if you're going to play mephisto you need to bring champion with you every time so might as well have the best champion that i can all right, that is it for me, guys. Hope you um, like the video. Uh, are you ranking anyone? Who? Uh, let me know. Uh, and I hope this little bit of inventory tip about uh, using your extra space from the sigil is helpful pe for people. You've got a few more hours if you're watching this video right when it comes out to take advantage of that extra space. All right, that is it for me. I will talk to you all in the next one. Bye.